Hi girls, so I'm back with a, another little makeup tutorial. Today I'm just gonna do a quick little eye look for you guys. I know most of you probably don't wear mascara, so I'm not gonna add it today. And it's just gonna be a quick little eye look that you can do at home. So I did one eye as I always do, and I think that's good to show an example for you guys. Um, I'm gonna go in with this brand new palette that I just got in the mail. Um, so, and it's all matte, so I'm gonna go and kinda do, as you can see, it's like a mauve color like a mauve look I mean <laughs> with um, pinks and stuff so what you want to do is you want to go in with like a light um, pink purpley color and you want to take it and put it in the crease of your eye so that's what I'm doing now I'm putting this pink color in the crease of my eye and I'm just blending it back and forth and that's all you have to do just blend back and forth and see then it is in the crease of your eye so then after you blend that color back and forth I'm gonna go back in one more time with that color just to build the color up so it's nice and vibrant in that corner or crease of your eye so then after I do that I'm gonna want to go in with a little bit of a darker purple and what you want it is to look like it'll fade into each other so what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna go into the outer crease of my eye so you want to start right here in the outer and you want to blend in a circular motion and then you want to take it a little bit and drag that in so the color looks like it's right under the like lighter color that we just added the pink so you want to keep doing that back and forth back and forth until that darker color is blended in with the lighter so they look like they fade into each other and they just go back and forth just however you would like it so then once you think that you've blended out that color enough you want to take a smaller brush or if you don't have a brush you can take a little q-tip or your finger and then you want to go in with like a white or a really light pink this is like a mixture in between the two and then you want to go and just stick that right where there's a space so it looks like it meets the darker purple in your outer corner and fades down from the light mauvey color that you just put into your crease and then you can take the leftovers from your other brush that or q-tip whatever you're using and you just want to run it under your eye so the shadow looks like it connects from the upper eye to the lower eye and that is it guys I hope you guys enjoyed and I would love to see you guys recreate these looks that I've been showing you guys um, I miss you girls so much and I hope that we get to see each other soon bye